Leyen für die Sozialdemokraten. Bitte. Thanks, Chair, and thanks, Commissioner. Uh, Panama Papers have showed more than ever that tax avoidance and evasion are global phenomena which need global solutions, taking into consideration that developing countries are hit harder. We still believe that only publishing country by country disaggregated data from EU countries and uncooperative jurisdiction would be insufficient. It would not help developing countries fa fighting tax dodging. In one of the Commission documents, it has been stated that the Commission has already started working with member states to try to prevent negative spillovers on developing countries from EU or national tax policies. This is an important step. We were asking for it in a resolution last year. Um, we were asking for a European impact assessment of our fiscal policies on developing countries. So I would appreciate if you could elaborate more on this. And last point, in particular, Action Aid has published an interesting report showing how tax treaties negotiated by member states with developing countries deprive them of vital revenues. When negotiating these tax treaties, it is important to ensure a fair distribution of taxing rights and make sure that also developing countries get their fair share of taxes. So, in this regard, you know there is a UN model tax convention that ensures a more balanced approach to the allocation of taxing rights, and I wonder what is your position on this, and if it would be possible for the Commission to negotiate tax agreements on behalf of the Union. Thanks.